handful of us got shot up with different versions of that serum. But they don't tell us what it is. They tell us it's tetanus. They sent us on missions. Even though the others weren't stable, some of us started dying off. Then a couple of the boys get captured on a mission. I heard the brass talking about blowing the POW camp to hell to hide the evidence. But those are my men, my brothers, not evidence. So I bust out of the facility one night and I brought them boys back. There was a nurse. She took pity on me wrote up some fake reports, something. She had me declared dead. This is Peter Parker, the one I told you about? Mr. Robertson says you have a story I should hear. Yes, I've kept this all these years. This is where the story begins. That shield, it looks just like the one that belonged to Captain America. The story of the six American warriors began in 19... The dark days of World War II. A team of scientists tried to recreate the formula. They wanted to make an army of super soldiers. But because of wartime chemical shortages, only five more doses could be synthesized. So five young volunteers were found to become America's new heroes. However, the new process was discovered to be unstable. Miraculously, no one was hurt. The process was obviously too dangerous to ever be used again. And yet, there was an amazing result. Each volunteer was affected differently. One's muscle strength was so increased that he became incredibly packed. The other can fly. The five discovered that their powers weren't permanent. They created ring devices to turn them on when needed. The five became the destroyer, Miss America, Thunderer, Black Marble, and the Wizard. But Cat, they were the six American warriors. <laughs> Years ago. My name is Omar Moses.